I think about how their two children came out of this and how they've encouraged their two children to also follow their heart. They've gotten in the way sometimes too, but parents are supposed to do that, I guess. Parents are supposed to take care of their children, even when it doesn't make sense. To what, Even when it doesn't make sense what the child is doing. And sometimes the parents learn from the children too. It's a two-way relationship like that. Now my parents are divorced and my mom teaches art and my dad lives by himself out on a ranch. My dad is writing a book about a monk. He's kind of playing the role as he's writing it and my mom is still searching for where she's supposed to be. Even in her 60s she says she hasn't found it yet. Both of their children have fully accepted a spiritual path, that that is the most important thing in their life. And this last weekend, when my parents were with me, I was able to share that with them more about the Hindu practice that I do. And now that I've asked them about these moments that they had when they were growing up that just felt right, it gives me more certainty to listen to my heart in what feels right. And it's the things that I can't explain. My father is coming with me this Christmas as we visit the spiritual center. And he's delving more into spirituality now, now that he's in his 60s. And it feels like a full circle that the children from the family that he knew he had to have would again lead him to that same quietness and that same stillness that he found with the monk in Korea. And so in that way, my relationship with my parents is helping us both grow on our paths toward God. And I'm still learning how to speak about it. I'm still learning how to say it out loud, that this is the most important thing to me. But when I hear the certainty in both of my parents' voices, and when I can cling on to that certainty, and I would say to my 13-year-old father who wanted to be a writer, or my 16-year-old mom who knew that she had to go to sculpture class. I would turn that gaze towards myself and towards anybody who feels that call in their heart to do something that is unexpected and out of the norm, out of what their family would think, that they need to do what their heart is calling, because that is the most important thing. <laughs>